welcome back to the Seventh House Art Studio. We're going to be doing a open cup pour with a cookie cutter. Okay, so I have two canvases here, so I'm trying to figure out. If I put it in the middle, it's all going to go down and in between. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe I'll put it right here. And my mix is acrylic paint, water, Floetrol, and I thought I'd give polyurethane a try. So I've already have everything mixed up. Hopefully I have enough paint. <clears throat> so while I'm taking out my popsicle sticks, I'd like to encourage you to hit that subscribe button, like, comment, share. <clears throat> Don't make sure I was saying, okay. So here we go. Hmm. I really want to do it in the middle, but it's all going to pour down in the middle. I'll do as close to this edge as I can. I've already pre-painted the canvases and they have dried. And I painted them with um, leftover paint, which like like in these cups here, if I have anything left over, I drain them out into this bottle and it makes this weird gray color. Be interesting to see how the polyurethane works. I know I'm not going in the same order, but that's okay. Make it a little interesting, huh? Put a little white in there. Oh, that would have been awful. have an idea. Okay, so let's get these off of there. And we'll do it real close to the edge on the other side too. So you just want to lift it up a little bit, ever so slightly, to let some drain out. We'll kind of move it too. do it here again. For some reason my red is kind of chunky. I guess I didn't mix it up good enough.
I'm tipping them over, of course, to drain out the, I almost said drain out the blood, drain out the paint, but also to give it a gliding surface. Halloween is coming up in a couple of months. I think I have more paint on this side. liquid paint or I'm hold on. Hold on. Pop some of these bubbles. You don't want to let the air bubbles pop on their own because we'll create pits. seem to have a clog. So I'm going to pour it out. I should have taken these canvases together. Let's try to move them together. Hmm. All right, that's not going to work. I definitely needed more paint on the canvas. More paint in the cups. I really like this right here. I almost hate to mess with it. So yeah, I did have more paint on this side. big clump of something right here. What is that? Oh, it's just that red paint. Don't come off too much. Well, so far I like the left side a lot better than the right side. How do you like the back of the canvas? <laughs> like how it swirled up there. Okay. So, <clears throat> what I'm going to do is add a little water. to my empty cups to add a little bit more composition down at this end. I'm 
This is just using up what's clinging to the cup here. some white. It's also a good idea to mix your brands of paint for a better chemical reaction. And this will all dry flat. that there. Why did I do that for? Okay, so we're just going to too muddy. See if we can get it more over this way. <clears throat> okay. Well, it looks like two different paintings. Okay, that made it more cohesive. This chunk of red is really bothering me. Okay, we'll just mix it up on the canvas. Ooh, okay. Kind of cool looking. Okay, so you want to get your little butane tank. <clears throat> Bust the air bubbles. <clears throat> like I said before, you don't want them to dry on their own. <clears throat> Excuse me. Plus it will create more cells. I wish the yellow would have showed up more. Let's actually add, see if we can add some of that yellow right here. Come out. Okay. Well, I will say that the polyurethane, as of right now, did not really create a bunch of cells. So, poo poo on that. Maybe some more popping up. Okay. Okay. So, you don't have to cover the whole canvas. I think I will do some touch up here because there's some pits up here. <clears throat> but anyway, there is your... 
see which way does this go. Maybe this way. Let me turn the flash on. Okay. More cells are popping up now. So I take that back polyurethane. <clears throat> Ew, I like that section. Kind of like how it just kind of fades out towards the side here. Some webbing, lacing. I like this section right here. All right, so uh, there's the painting using polyurethane as a pouring medium. So hit that subscribe button and come back. Thank you.